Now it's time to check in with Ken Rice to find out what's coming up tonight on KDK News at 11 o'clock. Ken? Hey, Bob, coming up, how people from right here in southwestern Pennsylvania are helping ahead of a hurricane in Florida. Plus, Pittsburgh Mayor Ed Ganey reacting to the video of a forceful arrest last week in downtown Pittsburgh, and where the PA Turnpike is going to be adding a new entrance and exit. Those stories and much more all coming up at 11, Bob. All right, thanks very much, Ken. Squeeze in Fred in North Huntington. Fred, you have 30 seconds. Go ahead. Yeah, Bob, I just wanted to make sure as far as the Penguins TV deal, are they still going to be on, like, regular cable and you're going to pay extra money on top of your cable bill? Is that what you're hearing? I don't think it's going to be extra money. I think, in fact, it may be less money, depending on what the, what the you know, what the deal is. Andrew, I still think I, I'm more concerned what uh, Fenway Group does with the broadcast because as a new owner of this, they can do a lot of different things, and I think they have an outstanding broadcast team with uh, Mears and Airy and Potash and everybody else. And they have the right to change that if they want. Yeah, and, and let's just clarify one thing. The, the streaming thing is for the cord cutters. So there's right. going to be an option for people that don't have traditional cable to get Penguins games and pay a monthly or annual subscription fee to get those games. So they'll have both options out there, both the cable and to get it straight to direct to consumer. Yeah, I mean, I don't think they'll just hire Boston people to do it, Bob. But who knows? And what other shows are they going to put on around <laughs> Penguins games? Are they going to simulcast Pony and Muller? The people want to know. <laughs> they might. You never know what's going to happen there. And that's the thing about a brand new ownership for a broadcast entity. We'll see what happens. Pony, as always, a pleasure. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. I'll see you back here tomorrow night, right? See you, Bob. Yep. All right, that's going to do it for us. Thanks for joining us. We'll be back at you tomorrow, same time, 1035. Same two characters here taking your calls and tweets. We appreciate it. Tune in tonight, KDK News at 11 o'clock, which starts in about four and a half minutes. All right. Good night.